channel guys i'm doing video i'm doing custom order for this fishing derby that the tackle shop aj slavin where selma baits at is uh they're doing a little fishing derby at a local pay leg and i'm gonna make some custom lures or baits for them to give away to the people who win the prizes i'm pretty fucking stoked about it this could be fun um as always got some 8-bit baits and some alpha pigment and we're gonna rip some pretty cool laminate um we're gonna do two inch coffee slayers two inch slick swims and 2.3 inch epic prey it's gonna be pretty sweet I already cooked this plastic sauce so let's see what color we're gonna do first let's do the top I shook this a little bit so I want it to be super saturated I was gonna do the video earlier and like all I was doing was mixing plastic sauce so I was like nobody wants to see that is that like the patreon like I was like oh you could do a patreon people could like have a little subscription and see the behind the scenes shit and I'm like what me stirring up plastic sauce in a bucket like there's no behind the scenes shit here guys like uh two three four five six seven eight nine ten that's what I kind of can't walk and chew bubble gum thing or, uh chew bubble gum and pat my head thing yeah, like maybe if you do hard baits and there's a lot of like cool shit like sanding and carving scales and stuff like that, it would be worth it. But for a soft plastic guy, like all you're going to see me doing on the behind the scenes stuff is probably dancing stupidly, stirring plastisol, cutting up chunks of plastisol. Like it's real. It's, it's riveting shit, guys. It really, really is. Okay, so we got a black base and some of the new, you can't see that, I can already tell, uh, the new 8-bit pixie dust. This is warm out. And I was going to put it in first so we could see it clear and then do the black, but I shit on that. So we're going to do it the other way. I'm going to peel this sticker off. If you guys are sticker nuts like me, like this holds the, the, the lid down, right? So it makes sure that your lid doesn't back off. Like, like, why would you throw that out? That's going right up here where the shit sits, like right where the pixie dust sits. It's like a bonus sticker, guys. All right. Um... We've gotten really into being really saturated lately, so we're gonna give this like, we're gonna start with a big fat quarter. Don't sneeze, don't sneeze. Actually, that's a shit, I, I, yeah, I said it, so we're gonna do it. That's not a big fat quarter, but it's a. It's in the air. It's in the air tonight. Trying to like stay underneath it. I don't want to breathe it in. I did forget to turn my exhaust fan on. I was always like to start spinning real slow. Uh, just so it doesn't just go woof and all come flying out in the air. Oh shit. Lisa helped me pick this color out and we wanted something with like a cool smoky gold top. Or a cool, this is like a goldish green and then like a gold gold top that's I don't know it's pretty thick you probably can't see that um can't really see the let's give it a little bit more I'll know I have to write down like when I do a recipe if I don't use two full ones it's just like a really fat one I'll try fat quarter so I know to like give a, a quarter plus a little bit I really want it to I want it to have some really nice really good color um, these are for, like I said, these are for derby kids, like a lot of them are younger, so I want, I want it to just be some really cool looking baits, but some baits that will still catch them fish in like a colorway that's still going to get them bit here locally. Um, I think the two inch slick swim is a, or, uh, the, the, the slick swim, the 2.3 prey or the two inch, like the, the two, two inch crappie slayer is probably one of my favorite all time baits. That and the 4.1 prey are the two things I probably use the most. Here's a really gnarly color that you get. Why? It's gold here, but it looks, oh no, it's just the pirates. Yeah, you can't see it. It's all right. It looks neat. We'll see it very shortly. Um, yeah, are two of my favorites, and at least around here, I think the two inch crappie slayer is one of the best sizes to have just because it catches a lot of different fish. I gotta turn my hot plate on, or these are gonna be so hot that. Yeah, the two inch crappie slayer is just a great size to use. Um, you can catch panfish, 
small and large bass, catfish, carp, so many different species on that one little do, 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 do. So I figured that would be a really good one. Um, the slick swim is the same way. Uh, the the crappie slayer works really good on a bobber. The slick swim, you just cast it out and just you can reel it in little bumps. Same with the prey, just like steady retrieve, great roll, great kick. Um, something with a dark top and a bright bright belly is gonna look real good doing this through the through the water. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get that degassed. I'm gonna get that heated up, and I will come back and we'll do the belly. All right, we are back, and holy shit, if I didn't almost forget to record this, that would have been neat. I mean, I'm doing more of these, but still, it would have been like the second or third time I've had to mess with this video. Get all that air out of there. There we go. All right, uh, we got our front, this, or our top. This one's got, it's not exactly the way I would have went into That's all right. And fill that up. Go back and belly. So, because that's a front and back, and this is a top, uh, a top and bottom, and this is a back and belly. So you have to make sure that you do it the right way. And I might have uh, got it not exactly the best way. I like to have that. Um, wing nut in the front, if your wing nut's in the front, you just, like, where that wing nut is is where your next hole's gonna be, so you can just slide that wing nut, or the wing nut is where you want to plug into your, your sprue at, um, so you can just kind of put that wing nut over top of the hole, and you know that you're in the right spot, on top of your sprue. But these are looking nice. This color is looking nice. <sighs> this is a cool one. I might end up putting this on the website. It was a uh, custom color. I'm probably definitely going to at least put it into their end of the store. 8 bit baits. Look at that. That is the uh, Warmouth and Triton. Oh, sorry, this is Warmouth. This has got some Triton and also some Alpha Pigments Gold in there, Gold, Diamond Gold. But yeah, look at that. Together, they look super good. I'm stoked on them. We'll come back. I'm gonna go eat dinner and let these cool, and we'll be back. All right, guys, what is going on? It's a little bit later. I had a little dinner, hung out with my wife and one of my kids for a little bit. And now these are cool, and we're going to come out and check them. I like this colorway. I think it came out pretty nice. Um, this warm house got a good green gold. It's a, it's a super ship, so. All right, let's check out what we use first. What is going on, guys? Made a little video the other day, but I cocked that up, so we're gonna do it again. Here's a little sneak peek. Here's a little sneak peek. We're doing baits for a um, little local fishing derby. These are the prizes. These look amazing. Um, while this looks great, I just don't think it, well, maybe it does show the color as well. I like it better looking on these two baits. So we're gonna make some of these guys. Uh, we'll be right back, do the injection. I already made the color and stuff. Like I said, I cocked up the other video. So, coming in right now. Here's our topper. Belly's cooking over there. We'll get him degassed. We'll be back for the shoot.